Hi guys, Frostfangs here back with uh, the Paladins video. Hope you're all doing well. We're playing some Vivian today, very similar to yesterday's Eevee video. She's kind of an all-time favorite, all-time classic, and a character that I would put in my top 10. Although at this point, I feel like my top 10 is more like a top 20, how many characters I tell you are in there, but uh, yeah. The build is very close to where it has always been, movement speed, ammo, and the mindset, which is what we're playing with today, specifically like Booby Trap and the Reveal, which is my favorite, even though the other two I also really like. She's a very, very solid character. I'm really going to try not to repeat myself too much in this video because a lot of what I said in the last Vivian video, but also the Eevee video applies here. So maybe if you watch those or check them out if you haven't seen them, because uh, yeah, I'm going to focus a little bit more on the gameplay in this one and hopefully just play Vivian the way I usually play her, turn my brain off a little bit and uh, demonstrate, you know, why I like her kit, even though it is really simple. There are the teams, Genos, Zinn, Cassie and Fernando. Looks like a pretty trial siege, to be honest. Baku's going to be a pain, although you can kind of deal with him a little bit. Uh, Cassie, Ray, Koa and Moji. A booby trap and then the reveal setup the question then becomes what do we go for item wise because i feel like we need wrecker to deal with a mako especially if he's going for half shell so i guess we go wrecker and life rip to start life rip will fall off a little bit but i think it still makes sense i don't know maybe i don't go life rip. maybe i go nimble to start i'm unsure with the items because we need damage reduction too i don't want to lock myself into life rip don't know how this is going to go but, uh yeah we've got the reveal we've got the ammo reduction and the speed nimble i think is going to be the main one just given the map drop the mine down there really early and try and play with the team i don't want to get sort of separated by the uh yeah buck i'm just gonna clear that shield and then drop the q down and get rid of the vivian i probably should scope in a little bit because we do have a chance to do it but uh, try and avoid doing that too much because you're really really stationary reposition makoa general's heals team going kind of huge that was a really big general script the mine is in a really bad spot i tried to throw it there but it somehow landed on the side i'm reloading way more than i need to our team's got it covered though yeah these guys just went kind of massive there hello buck i don't know where he was earlier he's gonna do the jump i think that's fine he should be able to get cleared he's obviously gonna have an insane amount of damage reduction whenever he jumps this but we should be able to at least trade or take a turn of his health off and leave him so he can't just do the combo again at least hopefully definitely has been a minute i feel like i'm not playing us so well so far or too well i mean i did try not fire into the shield too much there because we don't want to obviously give him the reset maybe get rid of the uh yeah ray never mind bucks in the grip i feel like i died like six times in this one but i've actually only got three that's the emoji all on uh fernando she's gonna pay for it though yeah i feel like i need to stay away from the makoa and position myself safer than i have been so far we've got nimble we're very fast but cassie and the makoa are kind of outputting crazy damage on me so a little bit scared damage here on the back sure shield i probably should have popped that a little bit fast i cut that kind of close even though he didn't land it uh yeah dead to the cassie don't know how i dealt such a little damage to her i think i got really unlucky spell on the weapon and she got very lucky on her shots but i know she's gone damage on the back yeah this is how i should be playing her. i don't need to get too close we get 100 damage even at that range i need to just be further back safe damage is the play the reveal is huge here though um, as you can sort of see there that reveal lasts forever it feels like there goes the ray definitely i'm not utilizing her kit insanely well i'm just gonna go through that shield to make it a bit easier for the team but uh yeah we're still doing fine that's what I'm trying to say. It's looking more jank than it actually is. We're effective, it just doesn't look like it. That's Cope right there. Definitely want to try and spam the mine. That was a really cheeky knock on the Buck. Not Buck, and Makoa. I got the ult here, but I don't really want to use it just in case I die in a second. We're going to throw the mine there. Try and position myself in a way where Cassie can't hit me too easily for free. Don't feel like I'm playing this right grip from the Jonas is honestly kind of insane. Our damage on that Buck is just so low. He's got such insane damage reduction. That's a general assault. Sure, shots there. We also don't get the ammo gem from hitting into the shield. He's melted through the Cassie. I'm fine. Like I've got uh, Fernando went for the ult. I think I'm dead here. Yeah, I'm just kind of in the middle of all of them positioning. Wasn't the best but i couldn't really pull back i need to just try and stay in the middle i feel like i'm playing as if i've got the extra damage from holding it down for two seconds and i don't i don't know why i'm doing that uh, more wrecker general said pointing out that we did get kind of unlucky there in that team fight one one finishing off nimble we got wrecker two i want to just try and clear shields move around a ton basically the opposite of what i said at the start of the video which is kind of fine because uh yeah it's kind of the whole point of these things is they are recorded on the fly i'm not like post commentarying it so so if i need to adapt it we will shots here on the mojo i definitely should be focusing her and not the maka when he's in the ultimate she is gone wow that damage is kind of crazy i guess now we fire into him we've got tons of ammo reduction teams got it covered here. These guys are making my gameplay look like ass, even though I'm doing fine. Just because Cassie's in, Jonas and Fernando here are going kind of massive. I need to throw the mines out more and uh, just play a little bit better. Like, I've actually been delegated here to point capture, which is kind of funny, but it makes sense. These guys should be pushing up. I should be at the back. Me and Cassie could maybe shift, but... Uh, yeah, throw the mine there. We don't need the one here on the point. We only have two of them out, by the way. So people don't know that. There we go. We got it. Trying to help out with the generals. Big damage on the cast. We also got the reveal. She should be gone. I don't know why I'm aiming so badly, but the speed here is massive. We are zooming around on Vivian, and the wrecker hasn't actually been that big. I probably should have gone for other stuff. Life would have probably worked it, by the way. Pop the ultimate. I don't know why I was so safe with it. Just absolutely melt through that shield. Yeah, yeah. Wrecker two versus uh, Vivian, or I mean Makoa, and he's got half shell. His half shell is kind of useless just because we absolutely melt it. I should have gone for the ultimate earlier, to be honest. I really didn't need to save it, but we probably would have gened it twice even if i did die at this point there goes the cassie throw the mine there i think we've got the three one we keep it up even obviously between rounds so i don't know why i saved it so much to be honest i think i was just kind of scared i was going to die straight away uh, he's gone bucks on me i don't want to you know get it cleared like that my ultimate looked like it was gone from the knock but it is yeah still there. i thought they cleared it three one there we go we are so fast we'll get more armor plating and then what 
I don't really need more record to be honest. We're already clearing it in like half a second, especially if you've got the ultimate app, it's just melted. So life rip, rejuvenate, arcane. It's probably arcane, right? I don't know. We are taking all the damage from main hits. Surprisingly, Chronos could actually be the play, but the effects on this ultimate are really, really cool. I like this skin sort of weapon combo. They don't really match, but yeah, I like it. I'm going to go for Death Hands, which is strange, but the reload feels a little bit long, and I think that makes the most sense, especially if the game goes on a little bit longer. General's going for the ultimate. I don't know where they went, but none of them went middle. Uh, throw the mine there, kind of on the side. They're all on left. Dismount there for the Makoa. They ran in so late. Kind of confused as to why that took so long. I guess I'm just going to shred through that shield so the team can fire into them. Throw the mine there. Uh, yeah, there we go. Damage on them. Sure, get that reload. Yeah, Death Hands was definitely the play. Heavy is so goddamn long even though we've got so much ammo reduction I feel like we need it our damage output with the ultimate app is just insane throw that there that landed in the wrong spot but it does give us a reveal right on spawn funnily enough that was actually a better throw than where i was trying to get it playing on that angle and trying to dismount them and stuff was definitely the play we got a dismount there on somebody i think with the mine we got them in a bit of a weird spot makoa's ulting i guess we just ignore that and go into the two healers i mean a strange angle a little bit too far up moji's on nothing i'm dead was that the right play and worth it i don't know we dropped off the point but uh we got 90 percent of it this might go three two they got recovery mechanic fernando they're saying whoops and uh, yeah that definitely is the right way to describe that team fight we should have had that to be honest that little jump strafe thing you can do with vivian is kind of disgusting shots on the mccoy i don't want him to just sit on there for free and the healers aren't paying too much attention to him fernando died there and actually just said how did it go through his shield i don't know what happened maybe it's got unlucky de single timing we're gonna go for the ultimate just to hold it again i might as well pop it because we gen it while it's up there's literally no reason for me to save it i'm just kind of wasting or throwing by not popping it as soon as i've got it up and trying to gen it that cassie did clear my left one though which is really annoying just by the blast they feel pretty squishy to be honest general's his grip range by the way is just insane that's a weird sentence but he's got the card i think maxed right yeah 50 his grip is just insanely far reaching compared to normal again i'm a little bit too far forward now we need to pull back and we've got enough speed so it's kind of fine johnson's on massive streak he's emoting i thought he was going for the ultimate uh, okay that knock kind of threw the buck off a little bit my tracking is so bad i should be scoping him more than i am at the same time i don't want to do it too much which is what i said at the start i was just kind of playing it wrong i feel like i'm kind of playing it more normally now my car ulted there for some reason that's the fernando ultimate also kept with the zin up i think it's also just generally been a really good game in case i didn't say that already uh, there's the mine knock on the cassie that was so cheeky i can't hit her feet there are you kidding me what is that angle that general scoop is just like a cm too high for me to get the angle there shots on him uh yeah there goes the makoa just gonna push him here yeah the speed was definitely the play playing sort of more mobile vivian i think was the way to go because that way we can just position ourselves way more aggressively and differently than it maybe you usually would have Vivian. even though this is probably the right way to play her it's kind of normally how i do it but i don't know if i've done that in videos in a while sort of played vivian like this it's not even necessarily what i was trying to go for but like I said, it's what made sense for the scenario, so we shifted it. We'll get more arm plating, finished it off. Definitely makes the most sense, so we can do a little bit better. Wrecker did seem like the plane. It has worked a couple times to get rid of the Makoa shield, but I feel like we cleared it fast enough anyway that it didn't really matter too much. I don't know. I haven't really noticed that ultimates just in general in this one. Makoa and Ray have been kind of annoying, but uh, yeah. I don't know why he's pushing up this much on his own. The rest of the team are not with him. We got the ultimate. Kind of good timing. There's the Q. Uh, point blank range. Come out through the tank. Cassie's on me. Can we get the lucky knock on her? That did, but she rolled to counter. Am I dead? I don't know what I'm doing, but they're both on nothing. The ammo gym was huge. Uh, General's here was huge. Team came through. That felt like kind of a misplay, but it worked out in the end. I kind of panicked a little bit. I don't know if that's going to probably come across, but I didn't know what to do or what the right play was. So I just held left click and kind of aimed at them and it worked out. Hello, Makoa. Again, why is he completely on his own? That's really strange. There's the mine. We now know where the Moji is. It's just using it as a reveal. That's insane. We can just see where they're stacking up. Shots over there on the Cassie. That mine isn't actually going to pop, I don't think, but it is giving us the reveal the entire time. We just blocked the Moji ultimate with the shield. Have I ever done that before? Don't know for sure, but I don't think I have. Uh, yeah, there goes the shield. Team's got it covered. Buck is up and Makoa's ulting, so maybe we don't actually have this we're on it though uh yeah just gonna hold that click we should be able to get it should be able to get it there's the queue just gonna try and deal with this makoa he is out and the uh, cassie's running in but i think they've not got time yeah there we go cassie was somehow walking after the victory screen it did like a little bit she was not that far forward by the way but we got it really good game fantastic showcase of vivian not what i was expecting but it really did work out super happy with that match actually just overall Felt really good to play her. 17, 7, 27. Decent objective time, decent streak, decent damage. Cassie did beat us out because I was specifically trying to not fire into the Makoa there. Hopefully it will show there a few times when I panicked and did do that, but most of the time I was trying to hit the squishies or the Cassie on the back. Sometimes it worked, sometimes it didn't. It wasn't perfect, but yeah, the team overall just shredded. Massive props to these guys. They all played really, really well. Their team overall played really well, even though their stat is obviously going to be a little bit uneven. Uh, the Cassie did a really good job. The Emoji did too. She was super annoying. Buck was annoying at the start and sort of fell off towards the end somehow, I guess, just because the team was paying more attention to him. Uh, Makoa did really well, but positioning wise was off a few times and Ray healed. Just a great game. Even though they lost it, they put up an insanely good fight. Their damage stat is a little bit lower than I was expecting it to be, but obviously Fernando was blocking a lot of that. And uh, yeah, Jonas was also shooting a tiny bit, but didn't seem to actually run the step that I was expecting him to there because he was going for the void grip. That really did work. And that one, I don't know if that's like his default thing for Jonas or if he grabbed it to counter like the buck and stuff, but that is definitely one that I need to make a video on at some point. Your trade off you're making for it for like damage and CC and stuff, I think will actually be worth it a lot of time, but that's a topic for a different video. Vivian really did work. I could do a game too, but I'm not going to top that one, so I'm going to cut it here that was a great scenario for it skin was really good
really cool to use as well actually which i haven't picked up in forever the build setup overall in that one did work really well opportunity might have been better in some of the fights but boot trap overall is definitely my favorite and did work the best there in my opinion just because the mine was super useful the reveal on it was massive the ammo gem i sometimes didn't actually feel like it was enough but it was we got death hands which helped a little bit but was still fronting out of ammo surprisingly because the fights went on quite a while and then the speed yeah, just perfect Vivian there, really. So yeah, that is where I want to cut it. Pretty much exactly what I was hoping for for Vivian, just in a different way than what I was expecting when I introed the video. But yeah, I'll see you guys all really, really soon. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know what you want to see me do next. And as always, stay frosty.